Yes, Team Fasberade, another home workout. All you need is 20 minutes of time and around two square meters of a floor and you can get going. Today's workout is an interval training, five rounds of three minutes of work with one minute of rest in between. Warm up will be quick, just three movements for one round, then I'll get into the movements and the scaling options of today. For the warm up, we're going to start with some double bottom burpees. Jump down to the floor, jump your feet next to your hands, back to the floor, and come all the way up to extension. That is one rep, you are going to collect 10. Then you get onto the floor, and we collect 20 single leg V-ups. That means 10 on each side, straighten out, tap one leg, other one, and collect your 20 reps. Finish off by quickly shooting the heart rate up with some jumping jacks and make sure you reach 40. After that, I'm going to ask you to grab a timer, either one on your phone that is actually an interval timer or just a watch or a clock. If you go for the beginner version today, you're going to do five rounds of three minutes where you go for a maximum amount of rounds of three burpees, standing tall, jumping down, coming up and finishing with a jump. Then six couch push-ups, nice and high plank to the edge of a couch or a chair, chest comes down and you push yourself up, finishing the round with nine shotguns. I come on the floor, can place my hands next to my hips, I'm going to straighten out my legs, tuck them back in and straighten out. You keep moving for three minutes, collect as many rounds as you can, then take a full minute of rest. Repeat this five times and the total amount of rounds you finished is going to be your score. If you go for intermediate, we make it a little bit harder by changing the couch push-ups into pike push-ups where you stand in a downward facing dog and we're going to mimic a handstand push-up. My hands are slightly outside shoulder width. I'm gonna push my chest to my knees and I bring the top of my head to the floor and push myself up. Six reps, we're gonna make it a little bit harder on the court as well by switching the shotguns to V-ups. Straighten out all the way into a hollow hold and then squeeze together and your hands touch your toes or if you're a little less flexible, somewhere along the shins. For experience, we're gonna make it even harder. Instead of pike push-ups, you guys need a spot against the wall and you can go for handstand push-ups. We're gonna switch the order around. You'll start with three handstand push-ups, kipping is allowed, then six of the burpees, finishing with nine V-ups as well. Very curious to see how you hold up, especially the last two rounds versus the first two rounds and if you're able to pace yourself a little bit. When you're done, I want to do a little bit of a stretch and we're going to go for the scorpion stretch. Basically what that looks like is lying on the floor, bringing the hands to the side, one foot up and I'm going to drop that all the way to the other side and hang out over here. Ideally, you keep your shoulders on the floor and just let your leg hang and relax. Do that for two minutes on each side. Then, high five yourself. Good job. Lock your score on me on the whiteboard and I will see you in the next one.